Huh? Togepi came out of its egg. You've nicknamed it Togepi? Ah, let's see. So yes, I was actually going to do this off-camera, so to speak, but, uh... Maybe I won't. Bo, go take her right away. Well, wait a minute. What happened? What did I do? Oh, I'm already in that box. Okay, anyway. Oh, go take a snooze. And, uh... Yeah, you can work too. Why not? And we're gonna get Eliza. And... Jesse. Yeah, that looks about right. Yes, yes. What fun. You know what? I never started my stopwatch. And now it's been started. So what a weird way to start this particular session, huh? With an egg hatching and all that. And I can't stress this enough. This egg I'm not gonna keep. It's gonna go into my, you know, box of mystery. Cause technically it didn't die, but I'm also not allowed to use it due to extrapolating circumstances, if I said that correctly. So, yes. Let us continue, shall we? Actually, hold on. How many lemonades do I have? Twelve should be alright. Oh! Before I wander off too far, though, Here we go. Buena! Today's password is bug. Don't forget it. I won't. Except I think I walked right by the tower. No? Wait, where is the tower? It's down here. So I did kind of walk right by the tower. Yes. Hola, buena! Hi! Did you tune into my radio show? Do you remember today's password? Oh wow, thank you! What was your name again? Joe, okay. Come on, Joe, join the show. Everything rhymes with Joe. Ready, everyone ready? I want you to sh yeah, I want to hear you shout out today's password for Joe. It's grass. No. Bog! Yippee! That's right! You did tune in! I'm so happy! You earned one point! Congrats! 
Yep, our contestant was Joe. Thanks for coming. I hope the listeners will all come too. I'll be waiting. I like Buena. She's excitable. Can I buy anything interesting? I can buy an Ultra Ball, a full restore. I can buy a nugget. I can buy nuggets! I can buy nuggets! I mean, I know I went through this list before, and I was like, oh, rare candy. Ooh. I didn't somehow fail to notice I can buy nuggets worth 5,000 Poké Dollars. That's crazy. I think this is a crystal exclusive, too. This is something I gotta do. Something I gotta do right now. That's a station. As it turns out, I missed a very important item here. Where is it? Well, while I'm in the neighborhood. Hey, wait a minute, who are you? Where's the medicine lady? Ooh! You know what? Let's do it! Jesse, you're getting a perm. Yay! You are the name raider. I'm looking for something else. I'm looking for a specific thing that is in Goldenrod City. Can you guess what it is? And I'm very sure I haven't been over here. The world is a psychopath. Bike shop. Hills, yeah. <sighs> I moved here, but I can't sell my bicycles. Why is that? Could you ride a bicycle and advertise for me? Yes, I can. Really? Great! Give me your name and phone number, and I'll loan you a bicycle. Joe borrowed a bicycle. My bicycles are first rate. You can ride them anywhere. It's a shiny new bicycle. Kinda like the one I have. So yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah! Yeah, 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 yeah! Bicycle! Things are gonna go just a bit faster now. Let's see, I've already been through there. So. No, 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 no. Yeah! That's more like it. Wanna fight? Oh, no. Guess not. Printed out my favorites for my Pokedex and stuck them on my bag. What about you? You wanna go? Yeah. My Pokemon are simply darling. Let me tell you how proud my darlings make me. So we're gonna get some switch out experience for, uh, Yggdrasil real quick. Unless Pokefan Beverly completely destroys me. Entirely possible. Nah, I think I'm okay. Although, once again, I think I'm... No, no. Aberrenbo can take care of this. No, no. No, no! Oh. That's not bad, then. You know what? I keep forgetting to shut up during fights. 
because I was going to fast forward through them. Let's do that from now on. I can't... I can't... <coughs> I can beat you in pride, but... Money, money. My friend keeps a marrow. I find them very endearing. Oh, I wish I... For a mar marrow of my own. So, I'm in the middle of some grass here. Maybe I should go to the thick grass instead. Because I have absolutely no idea what's in the National Park. But we're about to find out. Hey guys, guess what? I might get a Psyduck after all. Which would be great. I hope it doesn't know Psychic right now. Otherwise, this could be very bad. Tail Whip I'm okay with. Ah. Ha! Remember the last time I fought a Psychic Pokemon I was trying to catch, and I used Jesse, and I scared the crap out of myself? Well, that might happen again. Oh, what? I... yeah, okay. Remember the last time I fought a Psyduck and I thought it was part Psychic? <laughs> Never mind. Just never mind. If he hits Jesse, it's gonna hurt like hell. One, two, three. Yes! Psyduck was got. And I have the perfect name for this thing, too. The only time it can use its psychic power is when its sleeping brain cells happen to wake. Give a nickname to Psyduck? Yes. We're gonna call you... Psy... Man... The... No regrets! Okay, we can bug out of here now. Hello. I'm printing out my Pokedex. You can also print out stuff like mail and your PC boxes. Cool, cool. This is mail I got from my daughter. It cheers me up. Trainer tips! Print out mail by opening it and then pressing start. There's lots of trainers here. I wonder if they come back... Like, I wonder if there's different ones during the day. Because I seem to remember that being a thing. Hey buddy, you wanna go? Guess so. The world of Pokémon is deep! There are still lots of things we don't know. But I know more than you do! We'll see about that. What's your name? Oh, new trainer type. Schoolboy Jack. Ha! <laughs> Alright. Example, there are 50 kinds of TMs. Traded Pokemon level up faster. Your knowledge is impressive. I like that. Want to trade battle tips? I'll phone if I get any good info. 
Would you tell me your number? Eh, why not? I'll call you if I hear anything. So there's something I gotta do. Right now. Right now. I think you know what it is. Smash Brothers! And I'm sure at least one of you is sitting out there going, No! That was a move that could have been put on somebody else with a higher stat! You idiot! Well, too bad. I want my Smash Brothers Jigglypuff. Which I think I more or less have right now, don't I? You know, Sing, Pound, uh, Rollout. What's the last one it has? Just... Is there like a move called Inflate or something? I don't know. Roll out. Yee. But there's actually a logical reason I did this too. Not just because, you know, ah, it's a Smash Brothers, but Jigglypuff is actually a bit of a tank. At least from what I've experienced. And not just from Smash Brothers. I mean, it has a lot of hit points. Plus, you know, you sing, and then you use rollout, and it's like, oh no, 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 you know. I'd like to uh, put this into action, actually. Oh, perfect opportunity. gonna go after the trainer, but this might be a smarter idea. And that's why I did that. Also, uh... I'm incorrect. Rollout is a rock move, so she doesn't get stabbed from that. But ne neither did Miltank. So, yeah. Hello. We adore our Pokemon, even if they dislike us. That's what being a fan is about. Uh, no. I think you're wrong, but whatever. Oh no! How dare you! How dare you! I'll do it, but I'm not gonna enjoy it. My Pokemon! So I'm just gonna go ahead and say that was incredibly stupid what I just did. I lost the battle, but my Pokemon win the prize for being the most lovely. I'm sorry, Raichu. I'm sorry, Raichu. I'm sorry, Raichu. For those who don't know, Raichu is my all-time favorite! So if I ever have to beat up a Raichu, I feel really bad. So anyway, that was incredibly stupid what I just did. That Raichu was extremely tough. And, uh, yeah. Eliza almost bit the big one there. Hello? Why are you staring at me? Oh, a battle? You stared at me.
Oh, you little turd! Mm. I thought you were staring at me because I'm cute! Well, that's part of it. I mean, what? I think that's all the trainers here for the moment. Today's Thursday. That means the bug catching contest is on today. Oh, is it? The rules are simple. Using one of your Pokemon, catch a bug Pokemon to be judged. Would you like to give it a try? Yeah! Uh oh. You have more than one Pokemon. You'll have to eat Togepi! No! No, that's not okay with me. Actually, if I were smart, I'd use Kenya, but never mind. Fine, we'll hold your other Pokémon while you compete. Joe's Pokémon were left with the contest helper. Here are the park balls for the contest. The person who gets the strongest bug Pokemon is the winner. You have 20 minutes. If you run out of park balls, you're done. You can keep the last Pokemon you catch as your own. I won't be doing that, by the way, since I already caught Psyduck in there. Go out and catch the strongest bug Pokemon you can find. I think we have a winner! I'm also gonna have to make a note. If I happen to stumble upon another Scyther down the road, I can catch it. Come on, really? Well, crap. There we go. Please hit yourself, please hit- Thank you! I don't think that's gonna work very well. <laughs> Well, that hurt like hell. Oh, crap! Well, this is not gonna end well. Executive decision. Since it was a contest... I know you guys are getting sick of me saying that. No, I'm not willing to let go of Jesse like that. Uh-uh. I didn't lose any money. 
Because, you know, normally you lose money when you white out. I'm pretty sure. I'm not willing to let Jesse just go dead because of this stupid contest. It was a contest, it was a safe environment, and if you don't like it, just go suck an egg. That's my, you know. Next time I'm using a goddamn bird Pokemon, though. I'm serious, though. I'm gonna say that was a controlled environment, so... She didn't die. They ran in and saved her. I'm sorry. Just, you know... This has gotta be the worst goddamn Nuzlocke anybody's ever seen. I'm going to read your thoughts! If you're reading my thoughts, you probably know I think that bug casting contest was bullcrap. Ah! <laughs>